All right, folks. So last time we left off, we were fixing to do the quest on the Riptide, the Blood Cell Buccaneers. We're pretending to be a pirate. We're pretending to be a crewmate, you know, to fool this captain here. Hey, be still, captain. Man, I gotta ask you questions and stuff. All right. There's my papers. Swabbing duty. I want the surface of the Riptide T shine like a star ruby, Swabby Latchkey. I keep a tight ship around here, and it's swab bees like you that make it happen. Well, water why wait in for, why cockle brained Bill Garot. Head up decks and start swabbing. Pick up a swabby's mop on the deck of the Riptide, then keep the deck clean for two minutes. They want me to mop the deck? I can tell you right now, I ain't gonna last long around here. Where's a swabby's deck? Man. I can tell you right now, I ain't gonna be on this job very long. I never did do well on swabbing decks and stuff. Alright. Alright, pretty boy Duncan. So he got a quest for us. Cannonball swim. Help out a fellow swabby. Keel Hall asked me to gather up some cannonballs at the bottom of the ocean. Let me tell you why this doesn't work for me. 1. I have tiny arms. Look at them. Do you really think I can pick up a cannonball, even underwater? 2. Yeah. I have a weak respiratory system. You could do it. I start to white out after holding my breath for more than 10 seconds. You could do it. 3. There are sharks. You gotta you help me. Do it. Latchkey. I've been demoted as far as I can. I don't want to see what comes next. Obtain six blood sail cannonballs from the water beneath the riptide. Oh yeah, what about that deck swabbing stuff? Will you pay one gold to swab the deck? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Well, I guess better him than me. It was worth the gold. Maybe I get to kick his tail later and take it back. Are you done or what? Oh, uh, uh, this guy's got a quest for us. What you got for us, brother? The bane of many a pirate. Gum disease. It's a real problem, gnome. I know you're new and all, and probably haven't ever needed your gums cut, but the rest of us pirates have to deal with a little thing called scurvy. It's why we keep so many limes around here. Well, we used to keep limes around here. Someone made off with our last shipment, but they can't have gone far, maybe to the nearby islands? Bring them back and maybe I'll see what I can do to get you promoted from Swabby. Obtain five bushels of limes. You got it, buddy. I ain't too keen on this Swabby the deck anyway. It's just not my cup of tea. I'm a southern gnome. We don't Swabby the decks. All right, let's see. Am I missing any other quests around here? Anything else? Gotta be something around here. I was getting a little seasick on that ship anyway. Hey, I remember you guys. Y'all don't remember me, D. <laughs> I 
Look, I'm sorry. Uh, you, you can sleep in the back of this boat. She's just asleep. She's okay. She, she's okay. She's okay. Man, she's back already. Look, you're gonna get me in trouble. Oh, she just fell down. Y'all see that? She just fell down. Wasn't me. I didn't do it. Alright, so... Y'all see any more of those? Two bushels. I think they some in the water. See one hiding behind this tree. This never works out well for you, girl. You got to stop sneaking up on me, okay? I ain't so there should be some more over here. Hey, we're all friends now. It wasn't me who came through here. It was the guy who looked just like me though. We're we're in the same hat. I know what a coincidence. Right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Heart punch and he is gone. Alright, so. Now we're going to find these here cannonballs. Are they underwater? I don't know. I don't know yet. You'll know when I know. I cannot wait to get out of Stranglethorn. I tell you. So those cannonballs have to be over here somewhere. Oh great, they are sharks. Those are visual looking sharks. They fighting each other. Killing each other. Ooh, look at him, jaws. Hey, look, y'all was killing each other anyway. You kind of in my way. Is there a diver down here? It's just like sharks everywhere down here. 
They're gonna see me. Look, you messing with a kung fu master shark. I gotta go up for a quick breath of air, folks. Oh lord, it's such a long way to the top. Alright, down I go. Just past that shark. What would you know? What would you know? He ain't gonna see me. Three of the six. Getting out of range. Can't be doing that. What is that glowy thing over there? Is that one of the sharks I killed? It is. don't have those mounds just laying around everywhere out here do they there's one finally of course there's big bruce guarding it a couple of big bruces might as well just get him out of the way oh he ain't gonna mess with me Bruce the friendly shark. Hey look, there's a little sack down here. I'm getting dangerously close for running out of breath. I gotta hurry. Basically one shot at that one. the sharks to the sharks <laughs> yeah I know not very funny a little boat over there moving around Let me jump on it. For some reason, it wouldn't let me jump on it. I wanted to, though. Totally wanted to. Trying to get it that there, Riptide. We're trying to get back to it. All right. 
there it is. We we'll have three quest turn ins there. We're off to a good start at becoming a pirate. I'm fixing to graduate from not so deck swabber. I'm taking over this boat. Somewhere it's a blacksmith. Where is he? I see there's a blacksmith nearby. You a blacksmith? You a blacksmith? You a blacksmith? You a blacksmith? <laughs> None of you were blacksmith, and why they got one listed on here? One minute, Captain. I got an inventory problem. Vest or the swabby boots? Let's see what they both look like. Vest is kind of cool. Kind of cool. Oh, the swabby boots are very cool. But I can't have them both. What gives the offers the best upgrade? Two armor, two agility, stand on grid. We'll go for the boots. Space, I gotta free up. One of the pirates. Man, pirates are stupid. I, I mean, you know, pirates are the coolest people I know. Pirates, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> pirates are great. Hey, 
I don't really like being a pirate captain. Yeah, man, that's my favorite. Yeah, you guys are wonderful. Oh, so I didn't read the report. Oh, well. This wants me to report to someone else on a different ship. Basically, they're done with me here. Y'all lucky I didn't have to take any of you down. At least not yet. I'm very glad I had to leave. What can I do for you? See you around. Iron patch. Oh, well, Blasty. We've got some work to do. How much experience have you got with cannons? Oh hmm. yeah, I'm good with Really? Them. Well, mm -hmm. how about with ancient, fallen apart pirate cannons? Oh yeah, them. We've got a few cannons up decks that work the old-fashioned way. You load one cannonball in uh -huh. at a time, aim, lock it into place, and fire. Works well if you are trying to hit the side of a three sailor, not so well for rowboats and the like. Why don't you head upstairs and lob a few shots at Smill and Timmy Sticks? Yeah. Practice using the cannon by hitting Smill and Timmy Sticks five times with cannonballs from OL Blasty. Right up my alley, right there. Of course I, of course I'm good with a cannon, man. Yeah, I've dealt with a cannon one time. Oh, here's a guy. Here there. Ooh. Let's check out. Let's check out what this is gonna look like. Nah. Oh yeah, I gotta have the eye patch. <laughs> Gotta have an eye patch, man. Of course I do. Hey, good. We're going straight after that eye patch. at that time. Come on, turn.
Now I gotta go. Now I gotta go kill 15 ninjas. Uh, okay, no problem. My favorite. Killing 15 ninjas is my specialty. <laughs> right behind shooting cannons. See how good at cannon shooting I am. Give me a ride over here on that ship or something. And I've been here before. And this where I fought that giant gorilla. Or is this different? I don't remember. It's raining here. You gotta tell me it was raining. <laughs> Uh, it's pouring down too. Y'all see any of them ninjas? I heard one. It's hard to hear them for the rain. Some of my own ninjas. I ain't messing with him. I'm after ninjas. Well, that's a big giant beast.
Come on, we don't want to be fat no jack. Really, man. Oh, oh, oh. It's impressive enough that I've dodged all the monkeys and gorillas out here and just gotten the attention of the ninjas so far. Haven't had to kill any primates. <laughs> Considering there's so many here plus one big giant king gorilla. I'd say that's a pretty good track record. Two more ninjas. Well, it's gonna be a long way back to that boat. back about the gorilla. Alright, so... One more ninja. Alright, so that quest is complete. Ooh. I didn't see the hammer. See the hammer. Ah, right, we're going for the eye patch. All right, so old blasty. Ready for turning. So now we're going back to the ships. And the minute we leave this island, it shouldn't be raining anymore. Kind of like being in the rain. Makes me a little sleepy, actually. I'm staying as long as I can. It's a thundering. Like that, the rain is gone. Like, wow. Clear weather ahead. And if I was looking for those, they wouldn't be nowhere to be found.
course he's got another quest for me to do. Drive by piracy. Now that you know how to handle our cannons, it's time to hit some real targets. The Venture Company has found gold to the north of here, a rare type they call black gold. More like a black spot if you ask me. We're going to take that gold, but first, we need to get rid of those Venture Company goons. I've got an oarsman who will take you out there. Head off the ship down the gangplank and speak with him on the islet's northern shore. Speak with the Bloodsail oarsman outside the Crimson Veil. yards away Gee. they sent me on a long quest away from these ships way out there can I help you have a good one Somebody take me out there. Let me read this quest. Speak with the blood cell ornament outside the crimson veil, then use the cannon to kill. Where's he at? Y'all see a oarsman? I don't see a oarsman. Out of the boat. Nothing but sharks. Nope. I guess we'll just head that direction.
Oh, he drives fast. too fast. Turn ashore, we're done, we're done. Told you I was good with a can. <laughs> the best ever. worth a try. I almost blew up my own ship, mates. Sorry, guys. It totally wasn't on purpose. It totally wasn't.
Yeah, man, yeah, we did it. You need something? The damsel's luck. I know ye just arrived here on the Crimson Vale, but I need to send ye off on another task. The damsel's luck is the third ship in me fleet, moored over to the east. Her skipper, Captain Stillwater, is no longer with us. Damn those masked hoodlums. Anyhow, Iron Patch told me about ye heroics at sea, and I be running low on quality brigands. I think you're more than capable for this new duty. Congratulations, matey. Ye be the new captain of the damsel's luck. Report to your captain's chambers within the damsel's luck in the Cape of Stranglethorn. Be careful. I told y'all I was gonna be captain one day soon. I am too good for dick, Swabby. I might just become a pirate forever. Since they're gonna give me my own ship and everything. Here I come, coming to my own ship. Captain reporting for duty. Captain on the bridge. <laughs> Get to work, swatted dick. Got my own iron golem here. Brutus. I even got my own murloc for a crew. <laughs> Too bad I can't use any of that. The Brash Tide Crew. The charts mention a group called the Brash Tide Crew. This name is new to you, though you've heard about a few other newcomers to the Buccaneers. Maybe it's time you paid them a visit and found out what they know. Speak with Long John Copper on the Damsel's Luck, Enormous Sean Stuker on the Crimson Veil, vale, and Wailing Mary Smiths on the Riptide. Sorry about that, I was getting very uncomfortable sitting behind my doggy like that. Alright. So we'll accept that. One. Sinking from within. The attack on Booty Bay is looming. You'll have to return to Booty Bay quickly and inform the Baron. First, However, it might be a good idea to sabotage some of the pirates' supplies while you're still in their favor. The pirates keep most of their supplies below decks, spread out across the entire fleet. Sabotage the barrel of grog, the barrel of gunpowder, and the crate of cannonballs. Well, there goes my own ship. <laughs> so much for having my own ship. <laughs> All right. Ooh, wooden club. Making mutiny. 
Before returning to Booty Bay, you should do everything you can to weaken the Blood Sail Buccaneers. Unfortunately, even as captain, you're prohibited from killing other Buccaneers in cold blood. Only a fleet master can do that. You can, however, put mutineers to the sword, and mutiny can be awfully hard to disprove. Speaking of which, those blood sail corsairs that hang out on the lowest level of the ships have been acting awfully suspicious. Accuse nine blood sail corsairs of mutiny, then kill them. Mutiny. It's mutiny then. It's mutiny. Mutiny. It's mutiny. Look, I believe you've been committing mutiny. Finish the mutiny first. Better finish the mutiny first. Well, blood is all up. Won't get another chance at it. Oh well. What the hey? I'm already down here. Might well pull the cork. You need something? Be careful. Some more mutiny. But I did away with them all. Greetings. Have a good one. What can I do for you? You wouldn't want to see me when I'm angry.
Okay, maybe there's some more on the other ships. them on these other two ships. Finally get my own ship, man. This is the end of it. I gotta blow all these things up. I do for you for the Alliance oh he's one of those you need something have a good one can I help you last one be careful Nothing to see here. I'm not up to anything. Not doing a thing. Being a good known captain of a long ship. Even though I'm not on long ship. Oh. Oh. Where's the engine room? Oh, there it is.
There she is. Well met. See you around. They're all organs. Call of Booty. You feel like you've done just about enough damage, and you know the Blood Sales battle plans. You've done everything that Baron Revilgaz has asked of you. It's time to hang up the pirate hat and return to Booty Bay. The battle looms near. Report to Baron Revilgaz at Booty Bay in the Cape of Stranglethorn. You got it. It was a pirate's laugh for me. But not anymore. Are you hanging in there, old pretty boy Duncan? I hope you find a better job someday. I don't think you cut out to be a pirate. We got to go back to Booty Bay. Report back to Booty Bay, and then we will call this an episode. Because we are just about done here. Is our way through here? Like we're getting further away instead of closer. Yeah, y'all ain't gonna consider me a pirate too much longer. Nope. Adventure awaits. Well met, traveler. There's opportunity to be had here if you're clever enough. All right, folks. So I think we will pick up here next time in the next episode, and we will finish up Booty Bay probably finally once and for all. I don't know how much more I have to go here, but you know should be getting close closer anyway but anyway this has been a good episode all right folks until the next one y'all have a good one